Real women murders, not fiction. Love women, don't kill them. Giving real women, unknown women, recognition to the world. Please support our channel and please, please subscribe. And we have an update to some breaking news we brought to you at the top of the hour. A 15 year old who was shot in Fairfield this afternoon has died. That young woman died at Children's Hospital. Deputies with the Jefferson County Sheriff's Office confirming to us that the 15 year old was shot on Parkway, was taken to the hospital where she did succumb to her injuries. A 15 year old boy has been arrested and is being held on a murder charge. We are continuing to follow this heartbreaking tragic story will keep you updated here on air as we learn more and on the WBRC News app. drastically changed many lives in Fairfield. A teenage girl was killed Saturday. A teenage boy is now in custody. ABC 3340's Valerie Bell joins us now. And Valerie, the Jefferson County Sheriff's Office is offering few details about what happened, but you had a chance to speak with the girl's family today. Muriel, this is Janai Barker, but her family lovingly called her Cupcake. She loved to cook and she was excited to celebrate her sweet 16th birthday in a few weeks but a moment of sudden violence has taken that from her. He's gone. <laughs> Ruby Kroom was in tears talking about her cousin, Janai Barker. I'm hurt, we're hurt, the family is hurt. She's not a statistic. I want everybody to know she's loved. Her family tells us Janai went to Fairfield High Preparatory School and would have been a sophomore in the fall. Kroom described Janai as always happy. Never a dull moment with her. Um, outgoing, loved to dance. She was our cupcake. You mentioned she liked to cook? Yeah, she loved to cook. Her last meal for us, believe it or not, she made rotel. And on Saturday afternoon, this family changed forever. No one can ever know that pain until you lose someone close like that. Jaquez Young lives nearby and reacts to the news. It's tragic, you know, it's not easy. Young is part of Urban Life Community Church he is praying for all those involved. You hate to hear that anyone is losing their life, uh, particularly for them to be so young, uh, to have so much life ahead of them. A life cut short for Janai, who would have been 16 years old on June 28th. We know she's in a better place. I'm just hurt. And I just want justice. We want justice, not just me, her family. Now, we don't know much about the accused shooter. He will face murder charges, but his identity most likely will not be made public as he is a juvenile. Muriel. Here's what we look like.
Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.